All right, what's up, everyone? Um, I have to share this word for 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 people like battling, um, you know, especially at nighttime when when you're alone, you know, you waging wars in your head and you're reasoning things out um, in your mind as, you, as you're about to go to sleep. And, uh, you know, most often we don't realize that when we do that, um, we wake up miserable, depressed, you know, like overthinking things. Um, and it's not, it's not uh, healthy at all, right? Um, especially when we think about the negative, thinking about the chaos right now in the world and and we're trying to get answers for, you know, maybe lost ones or whatever. Or maybe it's just career things, things in your career and your workspaces that, you, that you're struggling with. You know, uh, those thoughts, you know, you need to catch it quickly while it's happening because it's a trap. You know, if you take, if you take a, a meat, <laughs> right, and you, what we do in South Africa, I don't know how other people do it, but... In our country, we put meat, we put it in the marinade, and we leave it there for for a while, so that when we fry or barbecue it, then that 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 meat is full of that that taste, and um, you know, so it marinates. So when you meditate at night or just before you go to sleep, you're thinking about all the wrong, so you go to sleep in those thoughts. And then what you're actually doing is you're marinating in those negative thoughts and you don't realize when you wake up why you're always depressed. Well, one of the things is, is to fix that. All right. And so this is what David did. He says in Psalm 63, he says, um, my whole being, verse 5, my whole being will be satisfied as with marrow and fatness. And my mouth shall praise you with joyful lips when I remember you upon my bed and meditate um, on you in the night watches. Right? Meditation is, is some people just unconsciously do it when we choose unconsciously choose um, you know, thoughts, you know, all the wrong and the negative. But David said, hey, I will remember you when I go to bed and I will meditate on you. And he says, my whole being will be satisfied. So when you wake up, you'll be satisfied. You'll, you'll, you'll be happy, you know, when I remember you. Um, you'll be full of life, he says. And, and he says, for you have been my help, and in the shadow of your wings I will rejoice. You know, like if you think of, of shadows, it's like in, it can, it's dark, but it's comforting, right? And so David had a way of like knowing, wow, even though all of this is against me, Man, I'm in the shadow of his wings. And so it might seem dark. I think it was Bill Johnson who said, if it's sometimes if it's dark, it's because he's so close. I'm in the shadow of his wings. And we need to see it that way. So when you start questioning and you start looking at all the negative and you start considering it, you must know, oh, uh -uh. I will meditate on you. I'll remember you. And when you begin to meditate on the goodness of God, even though it is dark, um, I'm, you're in the shadow of his wings and, and you and you and you wake up with that joy and with that expectation psalm 17 i love uh, maybe i must just read it and, and close with that in psalm chapter 17 he says um, psalm 17 uh, uh, verse 15 I will continue beholding your face in righteousness and I'll be fully satisfied when I awake beholding your form. So if, if I go to sleep and I just see Jesus, and I lie and I'm just full of Jesus, and I wake up, all right, and, and something has changed because the whole night I've marinated in the presence of Jesus. I, and that's what we should do. All right, so I hope that that helps. Praying for all of you, praying, praying if, you, if you've been dealing with depression, if you've been dealing with um, this negativity and all the pandemic and all that that's been happening, praying for you, speak life to you. Do this, and uh, I know God's going to, um, you're going to experience a breakthrough in your life. All right, be blessed.